This was a caftan fiasco. I mean, give me a break. Look at that, right? I put them on the girls, yes, but I performed on them two years before that. And I was just like, I'm determined to get these in something. Like, I'm gonna put them on the band. I don't know. I'm like, Todd, what's your color? <laughs> this is happening, my friend. I'm obsessed. Okay. Like the sun. Give you everything you want. Cause baby, you're the one. Your brothers and your face. Gotta stop and run late. What it's true, I tell my friends. Being with you just feels so. Obviously, I'm wearing an amazing cap down. Rocks, I know. But you know what, as I was changing behind there, I saw these shoes and I forgot and I was like, where was the last time I wore those shoes? Oh yeah, I remember. I was arrested in these shoes. Now here's the point. <laughs> the thing is, is that although I would not condone bad behavior, I want a major settlement because I was arrested wrongfully and they tried to act like I was a prostitute. Excuse me. I do not know what prostitutes you know, Mr. Judge Man. These are fabulous, okay? These are Gucci, they're amazing. There weren't that many of them. And the other argument was that I charged with them on. <laughs> that you charged an officer. Yeah, which did not happen. <laughs> and so my argument was I could have charged with them because obviously I'm good in a pump, but I did not was the point. And they appreciated my honesty. So not only was I acquitted for that, I also then sued them and I won. And I can buy more shoes. Yes. <laughs> Brett Not Kitties. We'll be back. Join us for another episode or a snippet, whatever you want to call it, of Wardrobe Junkies.